What began as a normal summer for the Coaldale Pool has quickly turned out of the ordinary. On July 13th, it was discovered that the pool had a faulty filtration system and had to shut down temporarily. Since then, town council has been busy trying to figure out how much it would cost to fix the problem. And the cost estimate was in the range of 190000 to 300000 and then that didn't include engineering that we would, the very, very best case, we might be able to salvage two weeks of the swimming season with no guarantee that that would even happen. So for two or three or four or five hundred thousand dollars, council just didn't feel that that was the right way to treat Coldell taxpayers' money. They reached out to different communities and the town of Sterling stepped in to say they could help accommodate the influx of Coldale visitors. Likewise, the Palliser School Division said they would provide shuttle service to and from Sterling. Ideally, we like to start it right away, but the first bus might not leave the parking lot until July the 29th. The town says anyone who purchased a season pass or swimming lessons will get a refund. Craig also says they were able to retain all of their lifeguards who will serve as extra supervision to and from Sterling. I mean, Sterling's quite far from here, so probably won't take advantage of the, shu the shuttles. Uh, my child is not even one, so I don't think it affects me at this point, but down the road it would be nice to have, you know, something, so I feel for the families who are affected. Well, it's kind of disappointing because it's really hot outside and it's like sad because it's a good pool. Um, it's good to have the pool called because there, now people can go to the spray park. You want people to come to the spray park instead of the pool? Yeah. It's disappointing, like my kids were saying, they went weekly, and so it's really sad that they can't use their swim pass. Um, but hopefully they can update the pool and maybe get an indoor pool, because I think more people would use an indoor pool than an outdoor pool. For Birch Study News, I'm Jeanette Roche.